With the 9-11 anniversary this weekend, a controversial protest could become even bigger. A few professional athletes taking a knee during the national anthem at sporting events has grabbed the attention of the country, and it's being addressed now on Texas college campuses. Channel 2's Kathy Hernandez is live tonight with reaction from our state. Kathy? Well, at universities, high schools, and NFL teams will take the field this weekend. And with 9-11 on Sunday, many people will be watching to see what players do on such a significant anniversary. A national controversy. That's Denver Broncos linebacker Brandon Marshall, who on Thursday night took a knee during the national anthem. Two other NFL players have done the same since 49ers quarterback Colin Kaepernick sat the bench last month. They say it's a protest against social injustice against African Americans and other minorities in our country. That's what we fought for, to give him that right to be disrespectful. Vietnam War veteran Woody Haggart, commander of VFW 581, understands it's the player's freedom of speech, but he doesn't agree with the way they're expressing it. I do not look at color. Uh, if that's what he's looking at, uh, I feel sorry for him. Students we spoke with at Texas A&M feel the same way. He's a mentor to a lot of kids, and so the fact that he's doing that makes it for other kids like, oh, it's okay to do that, but like, you're, support, you're supposed to support your national. He has the right to, to sit and be disrespectful to the national anthem, uh, but it is also my right uh, to never watch him again. And at the University of Texas, System Chancellor Bill McRaven sent a memo to presidents and athletic directors. The Texas Tribune obtained a copy of it that reads, quote, while no one should be compelled to stand, they should recognize that by sitting in protest to the flag, they are disrespecting everyone who sacrificed to make this country what it is today, as imperfect as it might be. And on the other hand, the Seattle Seahawks plan to honor the country and the flag in a demonstration of unity before their game on Sunday. No word right now on what they'll do. So many people will be waiting and watching. Reporting live outside Butler Stadium, Kathy Hernandez, KPRC, Channel 2 News.